So when it comes to curing, I've seen the light. As dentists, we spend a lot of time talking about materials. We want the best materials with the best evidence and literature. We want to learn the best techniques, backed by our CPD that we do. But are we forgetting about our curing lights? Today, I want to show you this new curing light by Dentist by Serona, the Smart Light Pro, and why I like it in my hands. So what makes this curing light different? Well, firstly, the actual light guide has a very large diameter tip about 10 millimeters in diameter. So a lot of tips are actually from six to nine millimeters. So having a larger tip means that you can cure the composite restoration or, or, or your adhesive bonds in a much more effective way. You don't have to move the curing light around so much. And sometimes, as you know, your nurse may be holding the curing light and possibly you know, miss, missing that area. So having a larger tip means that you have a better chance of polymerizing that uh, composite or adhesive bond. Now the other unique advantage is you can probably see from that image is the size of the actual curing light. It's probably the smallest curing light on the market and it's very ergonomic in design. It enables you to actually hold it like a pen grip and we're holding it like a pen grip makes it so much easier. So you can see if you hold it like a pen grip, you have much better control of that curing light. So you can move it around the mouth in a much easier way. Many dentists and assistants often hold their lights and different things in a grip that's a bit like this, a bit like a forehand type grip and a tennis grip. And you can see when you hold something like this, when you actually try and put it in the mouse, your elbow starts to, to raise up. So ergonomically, it's not as well designed. So holding it like a pen grip gives you much better control of that curing light and is able to move around the mouth to cure the composite or adhesive bond. So at 1250 milliwatts of output, it's on the higher end of curing lights and the actual light is collimated so we don't get hot spots within the curing light. So another unique feature is the transillumination tip. It's not just a curing light, it also comes with a transillumination tip which changes the light to a white light in a very narrow beam. So that narrow beam we can use to place around teeth to see if there's any caries or any fracture lines within teeth. So if you're in the market for a curing light, it's worthwhile looking at this Smart Light Pro. This ergonomic design, this pen style grip, and it's lightweight, along with the feature of the transillumination, it's definitely worth having a look at.